Hello, Jose. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How was your day today? Today it has been uh, very busy. Uh, <laughs> uh, the opposite, uh, like relaxing day without new things. I don't know how to say it, uh, sin novedades, without ah, new okay. things. Okay, okay. Uh, there is a word, I guess, when it, it is used in military terms. I will check for it. Okay, but, the, well, it has been a very relaxing day. Uh, I went to job, then to the gym, and now I'm uh, ready for the class. How about well, you, teacher? It, How was your could day? Be, it could be, you can say three terms. No news. Okay. Without news or uneventful, uneventful. Event okay. is como evento. Uneventful, uh -huh. sin eventos. Okay, it has been a day without news then. Uh-huh. Okay. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Good evening, Noemi. Good evening, Dina. How was your day? Good evening, teacher. How do you feel? Tired. <laughs> you look tired. Good evening, teacher. Is, is it hot in El Salvador right it's now? Much. Very hot. Okay. Yes. Okay. Here in Panama, it is very hot too, but as it is always hot, people here used to have air conditioning everywhere. So if you go to the restaurants, if you go to the malls, the whole mall has air conditioning. All the supermarkets and everywhere where you go, you have air conditioning. I guess that even uh, the, they have a metro, a subway. I guess that in the subway, they also have air condition. I guess because I never had get into one. It, that's one of, of my things to do. I had to get into the metro and know what is it to get in and to get out and to visit all the places <laughs> i want to ride there <laughs> you know i guess that most of you never had been on a train before because in el salvador uh, there is a lot of time without train but since i'm 56 years old I was on El Salvador train several times. I I went with my mother. My mother used to make a, she, she, she was a, a teacher and she used to make trips with, with her students. And when they went to those trips, she take my brother and me with with her so we visit uh san vicente in san vicente there was a a, a place to go very similar to very similar to los chorros but it's in san vicente and we also went to one that is in Zacatecoluca. I don't I don't remember the name, but there is a Siwanawa there in Zacatecoluca. Uh, we visited several several places and we went by train. 
we took the train uh, at the train station. It was, uh, do you know uh, the Reloj de Flores? It was close to there. At, at, yes, the beginning, at the beginning of the, at the beginning of the, uh, ¿cómo se llama esto? La Alameda Juan Pablo II. At the beginning, there is the Reloj de Flores, and there is the La Avenida, and there is La Alameda Roosevelt, La Alameda Juan Pablo II, and the, the train station was nearby. Teacher. Yes. As a matter of fact, there's there there is still an option to travel on train here in El Salvador. Uh, mm -hmm. There, in the same place you are talking about, in, in near Reloj de Flores, there's uh -huh. an, uh, a train station that nowadays is a museum. Oh, and okay. there, uh, they give you uh, a trip on train. Uh -huh. It's very short, but you can live that experience. Ah, you can you you can ride the 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 the, the train. That's great. You can I go hope, on on train. I hope it, that uh, in these years you can have uh, a train line again because it cross it it used to cross all Salvador, all El Salvador. From Aguachapan to to La Unión, and it it, it also has to Metapan. And you can you can go across El Salvador and also to Chalatenango, Metapan, and all those places. You can go by train. Wow. Nowadays, the function. only option. Nowadays, the only option is that train station called. Ferrocarril Museum. Yes, it's a museum. But uh, I hope that they can still use the same railway because I have seen several of them. They, 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 they are still there, the railway. Yeah, so but it will be very difficult because a lot of people have taken those, those places to build houses and the government has given them the the papers for those houses and now uh, before they were illegal nowadays they are they but have the, legal the, the houses government, there the government can can buy them the the, the plot of land and uh, make them go somewhere else, move them. Yeah, because but nowadays the whole rail, rail, uh, reels. How how do you say? Uh, todos los rieles del tren. Uh, uh, the whole train rails are full of houses. All of them. Yeah. Okay. Well, at well, least the they need that to, I know they, need, are... they they need a place to put the train. They could they could even put it uh, above. They can they can because here in in Panama, they are building it above. It, it is it is over, the 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 streets. So. The streets, the cars are here, and the train goes over it. They can do something like that. But we, we will yeah. need a train. And, and Maybe in a long away future, it could be possible. But nowadays, uh, well, I can see that government doesn't have enough money to make public uh, buildings. And uh, obras públicas, how do you say it, teacher? Uh, public, public, uh, public, uh, sería, permítame. Well, but. Obras uh, públicas, permítame. Obras públicas. Uh, 
对。Public works. Public, Public works. works. Uh, in this case, will be uh, streets and highways and things like that. Okay, but as mm -hmm. I I was saying, the government seems that doesn't have enough money for for public works because, for example, in the in the Carretera Los Chorros, they promised four years ago that they will build a new highway. But we still, we as, are, we are as still far as, as As far I, as I understand, uh, they already have the, uh, the first things they made and they already have uh, made the, the, uh, the public, uh, What's the name? So, que, que, que están ofertando con las diferentes cosas para que, para que, y creo que ya lo adjudicaron. Ah, okay. ya, lo, ya lo dieron. ¿Quién es el que lo va a construir? Este, acuérdense que hubo un paso ahí que creo que fue el de Claudia Lars, que supuestamente Estados Unidos iba a dar el 75% y El Salvador iba a poner el 25%, y eh, Estados Unidos se retiró cuando llegó Biden, y, pero eh, the president said that we cannot stop the work, and we ended doing just 5% of, of the investment was from United States, and the other 95% was from El Salvador. But yeah. the, 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 the highway finish. But, yeah, but... That, that, that's the reason why uh, they uh, are getting it slower because what United States has promised to give was not given. And uh, El Salvador is doing the things by their own. But it's better yeah. because that way we, we don't owe them anything. For example, yeah, all, but... all the things that they have been doing with, with the criminality in El Salvador is without any assistance from the United States because they have taken away the, the, the money they used to give for policemen in, air, in, in the army. And they are giving that money to o ONG's uh, things that are against the against against the the government so yeah teacher but uh, getting back to the train <laughs> i think that uh, no we that, will... that's why they is lower the 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 los chorros thing but i guess yeah. that they will be starting it at the end of this year because they already have given that i'm okay. i'm always I am, I'm always reading about El Salvador. I'm not there, but my heart is there. <laughs> <laughs> and and I hope, they say that the train, uh, I don't know if it's a Chinese or a Japanese investment, but they will do the, the train. They already have made all the process because first they had to make like, where is it going to be and how it is going to be. And then another another uh, uh, corporation gets the project to develop. And they already have made the first two steps. So I guess that by the end of this year, they will start the, the train because uh, they, are, they are already starting the, the airport or not. The, the other airport. Tengo entendido que tanto el aeropuerto del oriente como el, 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 el lo del tren iba a comenzar casi al mismo tiempo. No, no, los, no, no hay nadie aquí que viva en el oriente que sepa si ya empezaron lo del, lo del aeropuerto. 
I don't know, teacher, but they always make publicity about public works, and I haven't seen publicity about it yet. No, I have heard that they already have the los eh, los trendes los los cómo se llaman los que que los hacen en computadora que cómo se va a ver y todo eso eso creo que ya lo tienen entonces esa es de las primeras etapas entonces después ellos dan el el trender para que alguien lo realice y yo creo I guess that they is lower more because remember that two years eh, no one year and a half ago they decided to make the 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 sports events that it just finished so that money they don't have contemplated o sea ese, ese dinero no estaba con, eh, con o sea de que iban a gastar todo eso en estadios y todo eso y ahora en la universidad nacional también hicieron edificios y todo todo eso no estaba contemplado pero se hizo entonces este todo eso va va bajando para otras otras cosas pero espero que en estos días sí se haga verdad porque eso se tiene que ver eso se tiene que ver it, it is better for El Salvador if we have more connectivity and, and cheaper and is uh, less uh, less pollution because I could prefer to be by tra to be traveling by train than traveling uh, by car. For all is salvo. I don't know if you prefer uh, to drive rather than to have a train a, a, a train trip. It depends, teacher, because for example, if they are making uh, electricity coming from fuel, it will be even worse because uh, they will need a lot of energy. But if they build uh, projects with, with solar plates, uh, it could be the best option, but we don't know anything uh, about as, it yet. As far as I remember, they say they will be taking uh, the 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 energy they need from the volcanoes. Okay, that could be a a good yes, option. A very nice option because uh, the volcanoes are powerful. Okay, we we are with the reading. Okay, we are with the reading. Uh, am I sharing it? Yes? Or no? Estoy compartiendo el sí, reading. Teacher. Sí, okay. How serious is plagi plagiarism? Plagiarism. Scan the first paragraph of the article. What does the word plagiarism mean? Recently, a biology teacher in Kansas, a state in the American Midwest, made national and even international news after Christine Pelbron discovered that 28 of her 118 students had plagiarized parts of a major project. She gave them failing grades. Although this was the school policy, the students' parents complained. The school board direct, Ms. Pelton, to change the punishment. They told her that 600 points should be taken from the offenders rather than the entire 1,800 points. Ms. Pelton resigned in protest. Well, what is plagiarism? 
que es eh, plagio. A major project. Eh, plagio is when you take someone else's uh, work and you present it as yours. O sea, plagiar es agarrar el trabajo de otra persona y presentarlo como propio. ¿Verdad? Entonces, eh, ellos habían hecho plagio. 28 de los 118 estudiantes habían hecho plagio. Se habían agarrado un trabajo tal cual. You can, uh, by this time, you can take uh, someone else's uh, work, but you had to say that you have taken that from this author and make a, or either a footnote or nowadays you can put what is called a, a, in, in Word, there is a place where you can put the, 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 the author's name and the name of the book and all that. And, and, and then you are giving the material, you are presented the material, but you are giving uh, um, the author's rights. O sea, usted está respetando los derechos de autor de otras personas. But if you only take the things and put them in your in your work and you don't say, I take it this from here, then you are doing plagiarism. And I don't know why people do that because it is easy if you go and read something and then you say it in your own words, you are not doing plagiarism. You are just taking the information and giving it to the world that you are standing. Because uh, if, if it's a major project, you also need to be back at by others people work. O sea, si usted está haciendo un, un trabajo eh, serio, tiene que basarse en el trabajo de otras personas, pero no lo tiene que poner como que es usted la que lo está redactando, tal cual lo redactó esa persona, sino que pon, eh, leerlo y lo que usted leyó y entendió, ponerlo en sus propias palabras. O puede también este, darle... O sea, ponerlo entre comillas y darle eh, eh, que, que de dónde fue que usted lo tomó. ¿Ok? Now, why did this become such a significant story? Perhaps it is because so many people feel strongly about what is right and wrong. Although the incident may soon be forgotten, it raised some important questions. What is plagiarism and how serious is it? The simplest form of plagiarism occurs when someone copies material without giving credit to the source. However, there are also more serious forms, such as when a student pays someone else to write an essay. Some people claim that copying is necessary to do well in school. They have realized that their own words are not as good as someone else. Another common argument is that everyone does it, so it's not a big deal. In fact, it has been learned that even some highly respected figures, including Martin Luther King Jr., have plagiarist rises. Although some people find reasons to justify 
plagiarism. Others feel the issue is clear cut. They feel it is morally wrong and consider it stealing, a theft of ideas rather than money. These people believe that students who plagiarize benefit unfairly. They receive a better grade than they deserve. So, what about the incident in Kansas? Was the original punishment too severe? Do teachers have the right to tell students and parents what is right or wrong? Ms. Pelton could probably say that the job of a teacher is to do exactly that. Okay. Uh, what do you think about the article? ¿Qué piensan del artículo? ¿Han hecho eso ustedes alguna vez? O sea, robar las ideas de otras personas. No, teacher. No, teacher. Eh, y ya le enseñaron cómo, cómo se hace para evitar eso. Uh, lo de copyright, ¿no? Sí, yes, copyrights. En El Salvador no tengo ni idea. <laughs> Bueno, este, eh, well, it, El Salvador has a, a place where you go and, and get your copyrights. Puedes registrar las patentes aquí en El Salvador. Sí, hay una oficina no de sabía. patentes. Hay una oficina de patentes. ¿Dónde está? Eso no lo sabré decir. Pero sí hay una oficina de patentes. Es más, este... No sé si ustedes saben que una de las cocinas que la NASA ha querido comprar para llevar así a, a, la, a la estación espacial y cosas así, este es de un metapaneco. We have a scientist in, in El Salvador from Metapan that made what is called la turbo, la turbos, Turbo cocina, turbo stuff. Nunca, nunca han visto, nunca han oído sobre eso. La turbo cocina. La verdad, no. Es, es una cocina, es chiquitita, pero se puede cocinar de todo allí y solo ocupa pedacitos bien pequeñitos de madera. O sea, que hace que ese poquitito de madera se, se ocupe muy bien en lo que es la estufa. Y eso ayuda a, a que no se necesite depredar tanto árbol para cocinar. Entonces, búsquenla en Google. Es famosa. La turbo cocina. Mira, y, y, y él, él, él hizo su patente ahí en El Salvador. Y Estados Unidos se la está queriendo comprar. Específicamente la NASA. Teacher. Uh -huh. You can make it in the CNR, Centro Nacional de Registros. Ah, ahí. They have, they, they have an special area where you can do this kind of things. Ok, vaya, ya le dijeron dónde es. <laughs> Even if, if you are an author, o sea, si usted es un autor y usted escribe un libro, usted va y le, 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 le pone los copyrights. Porque si no, alguien más se lo puede tomar o alguien más lo puede publicar en otro lugar y, y usted queda como... Por ejemplo, yo no soy autora de libros. Sin embargo, yo tengo los derechos de traducciones. Porque yo hago traducciones de libros en, en un sitio que se llama este, Babel Cube. Entonces, es, es un sitio online. Yo entro, hago, los, hago las traducciones de los libros y, y me van pagando según se van vendiendo las traducciones que yo hago. ¿Verdad? Entonces, yo tengo los derechos de esa traducción. 
Yes, Daisy. Uh, good evening, teacher. Uh, in El Salvador, in the place where rain. Casi no le escucho, permitan. Creo que la tengo muy bajita. Sí. Ahora sí, diga. In El Salvador, the place where trademarks and patents are registered is in the intellectual property registry. ¿En where is it? ¿Dónde está eso? De la propiedad intelectual. In the... Ah, lo que acaba de decir el joven, en el mismo lugar. Uh -huh. Yes, but in, in my case, I cannot to do I cannot go to do that in El Salvador because uh, I already have done it in, in the in the platform. Uh, the platform presented books, and then I choose the book, and I contact the author, and told them that I can translate it either from English to Spanish or Spanish to English. And then we make a, a deal. And then I have the contract. I made the translation. I upload the, the translation and they publish it in Amazon and in different uh, uh, presentations in different things. And I, I even have the copies of the books I have translated because uh, I don't need to buy them because I I have made them, so I can download it and I have the books for myself. It's nice because I, I like I love to read, and I can read in other language, translated into Spanish, and the Spanish people can read what I already know what what is about. So it's it's nice. I like that that job. They don't pay me much because uh, people don't use to to buy uh, many books. But while I'm re reading them and then I'm translating them, I can uh, have both things in English and in Spanish, and I like that. Well. Now we are going to make the test and after we make the test, oh no, first we are going to we are going to make uh, this the exercise for the reading. We have to decide if it's false or, or true. Yes. Oh, no, no, no. You have to put the sentences from one to six according to what happened in the story. The teacher's story appeared in national news. The teacher gave the students failing grades. The students' parents were angry. The teacher left her job. The group of students cheated on an assignment. The school board told the teacher to change the scores. Well, what is first? Letter E, the group of students cheated on an assignment. Okay, one, and then? This one. Yes, miss. Two. Then? Three then letters. C. Three. Three. And then four. this one, yeah, four, and then five. five, and this is and eight. six. Okay, 
Let's see. Yes, correct. Bien. Entonces, después vamos a, a, a continuar con el reading otra vez, pero nos vamos a ir al examen para terminar con esto. Quiero ver si les estoy... Sí, les estoy compartiendo sonido. Ok. Porque va por un listening primero. So, I will put the, the rest of number four. Por eso llegaste tarde. Oh, igual, no, pero... Okay. Now the other one.
Okay. Well, if you notice, I already have put One. the information here. Now, the final version of a movie is put together by the editor and director. What else they said is added? ¿Qué más decían que se agregaba? Dicen que no están escuchando. No, no lo compartí con sonido. Ay, Ay no. No, te echar, no sabía. Perdón, no sabía corazones. Según yo lo tenía aquí compartido con sonido. Ah. Permita. Ahorita. Okay, Pero no pecho. me dijeron, mis amores. Creímos que hablando por teléfono estaba o comiendo algo. <risa> <risa> bueno, tan, en mi caso. <risa> tan bellos que son. Otra vez. Vaya, hoy sí. No se escucha. No la escucho, techo. Permitan. Fíjense que le estoy poniendo aquí que quiero compartir el sonido. Y no me lo deja. Voy a ver si ahora sí lo hace. Three. Hey, Erica. I hear you're studying filmmaking. Yeah, it's what I've always wanted to do. So, what has to happen to make a movie? First, the director divides the script into scenes. Oh, why is that? Well, the scenes may not be shot in the order they appear in the script, Different scenes may have to be done at different locations or at certain times, you know? So, the director is someone who is very organized. Absolutely. Anyway, many different shots are taken, and the director chooses the best takes. So, how is the final version made? Well, the takes are put together by the director and the editor. Then music, sound effects, and any computer graphics are added. And there's your movie. Four. Ajá, ¿qué más se tenía que agregar eh, además de, de las escenas en, en orden? ¿No lo escucharon? Sí, se escuchó, Tichan. Pero no me están contestando. ¿Qué más se agregaba para hacer un movie? No, bueno, Vamos a escuchar otra vez. <laughs> And the director chooses the best takes. So, how is the final version made? Well, the takes are put together by the director and the editor. Then music, sound effects, and any computer graphics are added. Uh -huh. ¿Qué más se agrego? Uh, music, music, sound uh, effects. Sound effects, sorry. Uh -huh. um, computer graphics. Computer graphics. Uh-huh. Excellent. And there's your movie. Four. Cheryl, these are great photos. What's your secret? Well, I studied photography in school. After that, I was a photojournalist at a magazine for three years. But look at these landscape shots. Is landscape photography something that requires special skills? Yes. Pictures of landscapes have to be taken with great care. You need to make sure that as much of your scene as possible is in focus. What about weather? Well, most people think the best pictures are taken on a sunny day, but that isn't always true. An overcast rainy day or a snowy day could offer you better opportunities to take interesting pictures. Taking a picture in bad weather requires a bit of a risk, I imagine. But the results are worth it. These are really incredible, Cheryl. Okay. Now let's see. One. Hey, Ray. That was cool. Permítanme, quiero verificar si les estoy... Sí. Le estoy compartiendo sí, sonido. Sí. Ok. 
Yes. Quite a party last night. Yeah, it was fun. I'm still cleaning up, though. What are you doing with all the bottles and cans? I'll take the cans to the recycling center and throw away the bottles. Oh, no. You should take the bottles, too. Nah, I don't get any money for recycling glass. No, but I think everyone should be required to recycle glass anyway. It's a waste to throw it away. Yeah, but recycling centers should be required to pay people who return cans and bottles. Then they won't throw them away. 2. Hey, Danielle. I saw you biking to work yesterday. Oh, yeah. When my car died, I decided to buy a bike. I figured I could do something about the traffic downtown and get some exercise at the same time. But there are very few bike lanes, aren't there? And in any case, cars use them. I know. Drivers who do that should be fined. A hundred dollars at least. It's so dangerous. Cyclists don't always behave so well either. I've seen them ride side by side and not allow cars to pass. Yeah, and I've seen cyclists without helmets, too. Yeah, cyclists should be required to wear helmets. And if they don't, they should be fined $100. Okay. Let's see. We were talking about uh, biking last time. It's good for exercise. And it's good for the environment, but we need to um the the people who goes by bicycle or motorcycle uh Have to get the rules and also the ones that are uh, in driving cars because uh, you have to respect more the the bikers and the motorcycles because uh, you have a bigger weapon than them <laughs> porque el carro si no se maneja bien pasa a ser un arma de destrucción masiva. ¿Verdad? Entonces, y si usted tiene un arma más grande, tiene que ser más cuidadoso. Aunque sea el ciclista y aunque sea el motociclista el que tiene la culpa, el del carro tiene que ser más cuidadoso. ¿Ok? Y eso se lo digo siendo yo eh, eh, conductora de carro. O sea, que debería de ponerme a, a la par de los, de los carros, pero no. No siempre, o sea, no siempre se comportan bien los ciclistas, pero ya que tienen un, un o sea, tienen, pueden ser dañados más fácilmente. Uno como conductor tiene que ser más cuidadoso. Ok, read the article, then check the correct answers. Okay, I will read it for you. Follow the reading. Animated movies aren't just for kids anymore. Some of the most popular movies of 2010 were Toy Story 3, How to Train Your Dragon, and the, the, the Speakable Me. In fact, Pixar's Toy Story 3 became the highest grossing animated movie ever made. Animated movies are fast becoming an important force in the movie industry. Making animated movies can take much longer than making a traditional movie. This is partly because approximately seven hours are needed to render one single frame of an animated movie. In fact, some frames can take up to 39 hours to render. Toy Story 3 took 1,084 days, or nearly three years to make. 
most animated movies have big name stars attached to them to voice the characters. Tom Hanks voiced the character of Goody in the Toy Story movies, while Angelina Jolie was cast as the voice of Tigress in Kung Fu Panda. Using famous actors to voice animated characters is meant to tempt adults into going to animated movies with their children. Studio executives know that the bigger the name, the more likely adults will tag along with their kids. To further emphasize the impact animated movies have had on the movie industry, the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Science began giving out Academy Awards for Best Animated Feature in 2001. The prestige of winning such an important award results in more ticket sales for movie theaters and more profits for animated movie makers. In my case, I love to go to see animated movies. And not just because I had three children, it's because I always love them. <laughs> and in the case of uh, Spanish or Latin American Spanish movies, uh, it doesn't happen because uh, uh, Tom Hanks or Angelina Jolie do the voice, because we used to go to see the uh, the Latin American version. So it is not the voice of Angelina Jolie or nor Tom Hanks, the one that we are listening to. What do you think about animated movies? ¿Qué piensan de los, de los, no le gusta ir a ver películas animadas? Yes, teacher. It's very interesting. I, I love them. I, I, well, sometimes I want to go to see the animated movies and my, my children didn't want to. <laughs> they say they are too, they are born. <laughs> ya me ha tocado ir a mí sola a ver las películas y después contárselas a ellos. <laughs> okay. A good title for the article will be, what do you think is the best uh, title for the article? Uh, I made a movie where so ticket seller award. The chair no escucha. Okay. Now, number two, render. Pardon? ¿Lo está escuchando? Sí, sí. Ok. E es ese, ¿no? Animated Movies. Lo que yes. pasa es que me quedé, me quedé leyendo los tres varias veces. Ok. Para... <laughs> Now, number two. Render. What render means? Relay from raw to final form. Mm -hmm. Now, number three, cast means choice actor for part, parts. Okay. Animated movies have had on movie uh, positive. industry. Positive. Okay. Let's see. Excellent. Bueno, ustedes ya hicieron todo esto. Aquí solo me están dando copia. Ok. <ríe> ustedes ya lo hicieron. Yo no lo he hecho. <ríe> no. Yes, teacher. Vamos a ver. Write the words. Write the words. Anita accidentally delete, deleted an important file. So her voice 
wasn't prepared for an important meeting. Read the sentences and choose from the words below the one that best defines it. Just type in the word, not capital letter or period is necessary. Criticism, excuse, prediction, suggestion, warning, reaction. You should keep track of your computer files. What's that? Suggestion. Suggestion. Okay. You know, uh, somebody steals my computer once. Thank God they left a little bag I have uh, nearby and they don't take it. In that little bag, I had my, my pen drivers. So I didn't lose any of my information. Because in my computers, I never have important information. I have all my important information in my in my USB pen drives. O sea, nunca, nunca guardo información importante en la computadora. Porque si la computadora se arruina, se pierden mis cosas. Si me roban la computadora, se pierden mis cosas. Entonces yo siempre tengo pen drives. Y esos pendrives tengo backup, backups en, en una memoria de tres teras. <ríe> no es que sea obsesiva con el cuidado de mis archivos, pero nunca se sabe. Ok. If you do it again, you lo lose your job. What's that? Or a warning. Warning. Okay. Number three. You're so irresponsible. You lose everything. No sé cómo es pronuncia, pero es criticism. Criticism, así como usted lo dijo. Okay. Criticism. Now, number four. It wasn't your fault. Someone else deleted the file. Excuse. Excuse. Um, prediction. No, fine. Number five, you'll probably find the file in the trash on your computer. Prediction. Prediction. Okay. Mire, hay gente que es tan buena en cosas de computadora que una vez one of my pen drives gets something, maybe a virus or something like that, and deletes everything from, from, from my pen drive. And I give it to somebody, and that somebody rescue everything. But it was not in... Uh, in the files that I had, it just have all the information, but I need to put it into the files again. But I had all the information. I don't know how they do it. Un programa para recuperar archivos, teacher. Sí, hay gente que es muy buena, pero lo recuperan, pero recuperan la información, pero no en el mismo orden que uno lo tenía. Correcto. Ajá, Hasta pero... los archivos más viejos aparecen a veces. Ajá. I was relieved. Ok. <laughs> Complete the paragraph. Use the passive of the verbs given. Just type in the verb. To prepare for a TV talk show, research has to be done. Be... Ay. Permítanme. Ok. Por eso no me gusta ocupar el, ¿cómo se llama? El teclado de, de, de la computadora, porque me, me, me lleva por otro lado. Bye. Be done. Yes, ok, now. To find interesting yes, <laughs> such as movie stars and authors. 
Next, the selected people must be ranking. Perdón. Be ranking. Be ranked in order of preference. The top choices are recontacted. To see if they can appear on the show. In some of them, if some of them are un unavailable, the next people on the list are invited. Has? Are. Are. Are invited. Yes. To appear instead. Vamos a ver. Yes, excellent. Y ahí terminaba. No, falta. Ahora, join the sentences. Join the sentences with who or that. Make any change, ch changes where needed. Example, TV sitcoms feature actors they are recognized by viewers around the world. TV sitcoms feature actors who are recognized by viewers around the world. A newspaper clerk has to do a lot of research. He or she is often new to journalists. A newspaper clerk who is often a new to journalism has to do a lot of research. Ok. ¿Y aquí se tiene que escribir toda la oración o solamente como segundo? ¿Ustedes que ya lo hicieron? Toda. Toda la oración. Va, entonces me van a dar copia. ¿Cómo va? Ajá. Uh, díctenme, díctenme. Aquí está todo más. Words in the movie are so real. Coma. Ah, permítame, permita. Ag agafer, coma. Agafer, ajá, coma. Ajá. Who works on the movie or TV crew? Coma. Has to carry out the lighting, the scene. Y aquí va otra coma. No. Pues de crew. Ah, crew. Sí, ¿verdad? Uh, the movie crew, yes. Has to Ajá, carry. Has to carry. Hot, hot, hot. Creo que es una canción. To lighting the scene. The lighting design. Yes. Ok, period. Ok. Vale, una preguntita. Eh, son cinco y ya son las diez. Eh, ¿Terminamos esto ahorita y lo terminamos o lo terminamos mañana? Um, ok, teacher, manas. porque a mí todas me salen mal. Solo una me agarra, la demás no. Vaya, este, es probable que alguna coma le hizo falta o que se le fue un espacio de más. Porque esto es, si usted le da un espacio de más, ya se lo toma como que está mal. Entonces vamos a verificar bien, ¿lo, lo hacemos mañana? Teacher. Para que lo hagamos más despacito. Se los leo para que ellos medio entiendan ahí cómo va. Ah, vaya, entonces si usted lo va a leer, yo lo copio. Ok, eh, no solo lo voy a leer para que ellos más o menos digan, ay, me faltó la coma o algo. Ajá. Por ejemplo, two is the allow editors are sound technicians who specialize in editing field script, punto. Eh... No, lo tengo, no lo tengo aquí al... ah no lo había Pero a veces sí no, no y me sale escribir, mala ajá. por más que lo por más que lo le hice de una forma de otra no me las agarra ah, la puse ya ah, se la puse ya Vean eh, el eh, chat. en dónde en el chat aquí yes. ah vaya miren aquí les puso todas las cosas él ¿eh? Ahí está, solo, solo separan un poquito por el punto, ahí tienen las respuestas. Ok, gracias. Se la voy a copiar en el WhatsApp. Ya, ya se, se la voy a enviar igual. 
Me lo pueden dar, solo voy a poner un poquito de espacio y se lo voy a pedir. Vaya, chévere. Ok, Entonces, no problem. See you tomorrow. Good night, terminamos chévere. mañana. Good night, tomorrow. Ok. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Take care. Bye, bye. Good night. Good night. Mm -hmm.